There are several different formats that you can choose from if you're shooting on the Blackmagic Cinema Camera 6K or the new Blackmagic Pixis camera. Those formats are 6K Open Gate, 6K DCI, 6K 2.4 to 1, Super 35, 4K DCI, Super 16, and HD. Most people out there would agree you should just shoot on open gate. You can crop in and get the same effect and choose your aspect ratio. There's a lot of flexibility with open gate, and that's true. But there are other advantages to all these other formats, and we're going to take a look at them right now. Let's take a look at reason number one is going to be your frame rates. If you need a higher frame rate to shoot in, that would be one of the reasons why you would choose something below the 6K open gate. I hear a lot of people say that they don't need the 100 frames per second or the 120 frames per second. I think that's a bit of a closed-minded thing to say. There's also nothing wrong with shooting in 4K or HD. There's just options in there to utilize those different frame rates. Another important factor is going to be your file size, which is going to equate to more record time. Let's take a look at open gate with this card I have in there. Right now I have 50 minutes and five seconds of record time left. If I go down to Super 35, I now have one hour and 33 minutes left. If I go to 4K DCI, I have about two hours and eight minutes of record time left. We have about six hours and 39 minutes of record time in HD. So that's a significant amount of file size space on your card, which is going to matter if you're shooting all day, it's going to matter for deliverables to yourself or to clients. I recently did a project for somebody. I didn't have a lot of space left on my card. It was a last minute request. I also didn't need a huge deliverable because they're putting this on Facebook. The advantage of this was I was able to have the camera further back from the subject. I didn't need to shoot an open gate. I could have, and I could have cropped in. I didn't need to have this huge file size for something that's going on Facebook. Another interesting thing that happens when we start looking at Super 35 down is we're now into a crop sensor. So if you have a lens that's built for APS-C, you can use this lens from Super 35 all the way down to HD. The case for shooting an open gate as your primary format, it gives you maximum flexibility in post, cropping in for different formats. I feel like it future-proofs your footage too. It's also great for the anamorphic sensor. And we missed one other format, which is 6K anamorphic. I didn't discuss it because I don't use it. <laughs> and the open gate, on anamorphic, especially the 1.6 crop, it will de-squeeze in camera for you. So you can frame your shots perfectly. There's a case for using the other formats. And that's gonna be if the 6K open gate is overkill. The file size, the amount of time that you're recording, the frame rates, all the stuff that we discussed would be reasons why you would pick another format besides 6K open gate. Some productions only want the 4K. They want a deliverable, 4K DCI 2.4 to 1. They don't want to have to crop it in post. So that would be a reason why you would shoot in that format. I would love to hear from you if you're using these other formats. What are you using them for? Have you used these for the different frame rates or to save space on your uh, file size or memory card? Let us know. Let me know. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Hit that like and subscribe. It means a lot.